Hello, this is the CRT man here. On July 27th, 2013, I went to the Salvation Army as usual for donation day 10. This first item I'm showing you is a Magnavox RR1342 C805 CRT television set from September 1993. This is actually probably one of the earliest Funai sets because Funai started making sets in 1993 and Magnavox was um, taken over by Funai. Um, next we have this no-name Chinese-made CRT TV. Um, yeah, it's cheap Chinese plasticky stuff. Uh, we have a Sylvania SRC2213E CRT TV slash VCR combo from March 2004. This set looks just like the Magnavox I used to have. In fact, it's probably the exact same thing. Um, this next one's an Emerson VT13. 20 CRT TV slash VCR combo from March 1990. This was before Emerson was Funai, so this is a real Emerson set. You see, it looks really big and has even like an old connector. Next, you have this Toshiba MB13P3 CRT TV slash DVD combo from December 2004. Kind of looks like the one um, that Sebi Games reviews. I think that's what he's called. I'll put a uh, shout out to him. I'll put it in the description. Uh, I think that's like one he has. This next one is a big Toshiba MD20Q41 CRT TV slash DVD combo from September 2005. This is um, pretty much related to the one I used to have, only it's not flat. Uh, there's a typewriter, I forget the name of it. Uh, a couple of little keyboards. I'll get to that TV at a later time. They had a PlayStation 1. They had a Xerox 6015 memory writer which was enormous that thing was huge they had a brother typewriter they had two vc uh, not two vcrs they had vcrs and dvd players <laughs> much more than two they had a big fisher turntable for records they had more vcrs cassette decks dvd players they had some um, pretty large speakers they had my phillips dvp 1120 slash 37 DVD player from July 2008, the one I donated back in June 7th. I forgot which donation date that was. I think it was number four. They had an Xbox original, and then that TV is a Daytron DCT-5002 uh, portable CRT TV slash radio from the 1980s. It was pretty cool. I think it was actually running when I first saw it. They had this thing called a singing machine and had a built-in CRT TV Kind of like what I had in 2002, actually. They had three Dell OptiPlex GX 280s. Those were all the same computer. They had a lot of LCD monitors, as usual. They had a cool cassette deck with a built-in speaker. They had some speaker systems. They had an Acer 56X CD-ROM drive. And um, they had a Magnavox PR1395. X124 CRT TV from March 1995. Um, yeah, I think it was like sort of a special set and had like the remote and manuals all in a, in a bag. And then on August 8th, 2013, I just thought to the Salvation Army pretty much just because I was around that area, uh, no donations or anything, and I saw a Sega Game Gear which was released in 1990. And guess what? It was only five bucks, but I didn't get it though because I don't know any games on the Game Gear. Um, what else? They had um, uh, my, the HP PhotoSmart C3100 series all in one that I donated back in April 17th. I guess nobody bought it, but then again, do you blame them? I'm pretty sure that printer was kind of crappy. Um, yeah, I donated that one back in Donation Day 2. Pretty long time ago. It was funny to see some of my stuff there, and I knew it was mine, too, because it was still kind of dirty. Um, oh, and for that Philips DVD player, they took away all the plugins, so now I'm pretty sure no one's going to buy that. Um, they had a 1980s telephone, which had the buttons. It looks, it looks pretty cool. And it's kind of hard to see, but they had a Dell computer stacked on top of a Canon printer. And then last but not least, they had a 24-inch Sony FD Trinitron Vega CRT TV. The, the Dell computer slash Canon printer and the Sony were in the place where you drop off the donations and then they take them to different Salvation Army stores. So yeah, that's pretty much it. 
like I said, on August 1st, I just went there because I was just pretty much around that area. So I just said, ah, what the heck, they might have something good. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. So stay tuned for the next Donation Day. So, uh, and next Salvation Army video. So thanks for watching.